target guys see if this one has gotten their resets well, i went out monday and it's friday now and the last target i went to monday got theirs and it's been a few days so i'm assuming they have i'd hope so oh wow i shouldn't be surprised i really shouldn't this is what we're dealing with here with the reset we're probably going to have the trucks at the end instead of towards the center that's really all and then of course there's new inventory new stock new stuff coming in marvel stuff whatever but this one has not gotten it this one's been sucking lately it used to be good oh well and then next one now again does not look like they have gotten it oh it looks like this part of town still hasn't gotten it in general but i mean obviously once we get to the other part where the target already had the reset monday obviously there'll be something there but i was kind of hoping to see some more targets than just that one with the reset being how it's days later but there's a premium box of hot wheels over there we'll see what they got and then as far as this goes it's just the shipper with some 34 in it actually i do have this one in bad condition but no one cares about that number three guys we're in the not as good part of town when it comes to getting new stock but this was the one that i found 35 at muscle was in the aisle but now that he's gone i can show you that there was literally nothing anyway so i just wanted to clarify they have that mini set that's not the new one i think that's 14 instead of 15 so other than that i mean there's this i've never seen that before but all right we'll get going now to the next one let's go to the better part of town with newer stuff number five this one kind of sucks but it's on the better side of town when it comes to shipments there's their shipper oh they have gotten their oh, 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 oh they have the marvel ones here but only one left dang it always too late for something oh what do we got for these same that i already have oh look at that though the new dragonoid okay at least i'm not leaving here empty handed just leaving with a couple of random stuff random captain america and then a dragonoid not too bad better than nothing they probably had the marvel mutters too who knows stuff went off the shelves pretty quickly it looks like um yeah i don't see the new playset i don't see the new nine pack i don't see the five pack so i guess we're gonna have to leave and settle for this and i gotta get that ten dollars i got to that thing is cool i ended up just getting the captain america in there and leaving the 124 guys maybe i do have ocd because it's really making me upset how i only found one out of the four of these i have one more target that one being the one that had the reset monday so they should have some good stuff they're always on on top ahead of all the others so we'll see if there's any stock left for us last target and they're building a five below over there richmond virginia people you know all right guaranteed that they have their reset let's see what they have for me to Ooh. well eh, there's this and they have the mutters so they have goodness gracious I, mean, I hate when they only have like one of something they have one more five pack and they had i think six sets or so here it's place that's still there no minis uh marvel minis at that there's this one um, i'll pick this one up of course these ones have those ferrari cars those are pretty cool other than that there's nothing they probably got all their crap wednesday or yesterday but there are these not too bad i guess i'll get them all right got some mutters probably my favorite finds of the day even though there were only three i like getting four of each so four spider-man four iron man's but three's fine it gives us something to do the more to just review them it gives us the opportunity to you know, reveal like the actual variant we get so let's go home well first i'm gonna go to walmart's but i doubt there's anything of interest there um but then we'll go home and review them all right definitely never been in this one i'm in uh, northern virginia very beautiful area but um let's see what their targets have to offer mm, oh wow okay now that everyone's out of the aisle um picking these up seems like one store at a time here's the iron man there's two iron mans and i already got the captain america and the black panther so not only need this the thor but no one's finding that one so we'll see um i'm not really in a rush because i know i'll see it eventually but and then they have the minis they have that one and then do they have each i think they have all three one of each i think they're all different at least uh they have these minis they have this new three pack with the two minis i have not seen that one yet they have the no old, old nine pack unfortunately the new two pack for hot was monster trucks and then they have the mutters that's right the mutters here two more iron mans and a spider man i may get them i don't know but wow just so much stuff coming in right now guys but yeah i'll grab these for sure those are cool and i'll grab that mohawk warrior and then i'll grab this iron man 
and I'll probably leave the mutters and get the rest another time. Those minis are cool. Definitely just got put out today. I'm probably going to get those eventually too. They're only $10, not too bad. And then they got 124s, but nothing crazy for Hot Wheels Moss Trucks. So they, all they're missing is the nine pack, the new playset. Could be y'all. I could just be drawing a blank. I'm very tired, but not too bad. Man, this Target's busy. I hope there's not a million people in the aisle. It's looking like it. Well, they did get their reset, but they have absolutely nothing that we need other than well i don't need that but that's only someone new thing i see and then i see this when i turn around just chilling there this place is a mess and it's very empty um actually they do have a new place i've only seen that at one other target but i'm not gonna get it so it doesn't matter to me this target is two stories i think the toys are on top they close in like five minutes so i kind of need to hurry but i have to show you this i've never seen a target like this yeah just like the last one i went to that i didn't even film at they haven't gotten their reset so i didn't film at the last one for that reason but you know i already showed you guys the target i was going into so i figured to show you what they had all right i haven't been in this target in a while and they haven't even gotten their reset plenty of 34 and 33 but Huh, I was actually really surprised to see this. This is the better side of town too for restocking stuff. But what are you gonna do? Not every target can be a W, but but not bad. I guess they have to sell all this before they do their reset. Oh my goodness, guys! We have a bunch of Marvel stuff in here: minis, mystery mutters, main lines, guys. By the way, in the background, you can probably see the whatnot show coming up. This is some of the stuff that we'll have in package vintage undercovers metal bases some rare ones like the seahawks el toro loco a couple poodles the exclusive hot wheels monster X live party crusher a couple 30th diggers a bunch of sought after stuff guys that's just the tip of the iceberg so stay tuned and tune in this weekend i will have the show scheduled by when this video is uploaded so check the description and the pinned comment for the link to the show and bookmark the show so you get notified once you bookmark it and also for the new users if you use my link you'll get a $15 referral to uh, spend in the app so there's a free $15 to use for my show so if you have not yet got it there's your opportunity it will give you free $15 no bull crap so use that opportunity and let's get into what we got tonight now that we're set up here today was an awesome day of hunting the videos the clips you saw throughout this video were made you know a few separate days you know I couldn't just go out to a couple targets and find all those a lot of them were duds I, I didn't record at all of them but most of them are Honestly, I did. Most of them are getting their resets. There are still several that have not gotten their uh, resets yet, but there are definitely plenty out there. So I went to a monster truck show this past weekend and I hit all the targets I could there with all the time I had. And first off, I'm gonna start with these guys right here, the new minis. These are the only three packs I believe. So we can just pick a random pack to look at first. Here's the first one with the Black Panther on the left, the Captain America in the middle, and the Iron Man. So this is a new packaging too, by the way. These weren't that expensive. I think they were six, eight dollars. Honestly, I can't even remember, guys. But still, these minis are like three dollars a piece. So it was like six to eight dollars. So still pretty good of a deal considering these are three dollars um, when they're separate. So that's what nine, at least nine dollars, not even counting tax. And I think this was, I think six or seven ninety nine. So with that said, let's get these out of the box and take a look at our first pack. All right. So since we haven't looked at these before, when you open it up you kind of just greeted with these little things these are the same things you see in like clothes and like shirts and stuff you just kind of have to like pull them out a little bit and kind of and they're pretty tough so here is the first marvel truck this is the black panther really cool looking actually i do like this one has the purple tires and the gray silver roll cage i have to fix the lighting but here we go better look here this is the side look at the cool little patterns on the side of the black panther that is really neat i like that and i do like the colors there's the top and there's almost like a honeycomb pattern on the 164 scale so you can see this pattern right there i think that's what's trying to replicate and it's too small for me to even notice and and see if it actually is trying to like copy that and if they even did in just a very small design but if they did it's so small i can't even see it guys but you can see the black panther logo right there on the side so really neat one let's get the second one pulled out the next one is the captain america one that we got in that pack this one's really cool i love the shield on the back right there with the star on the roof and the black stripe going from the top to the hood and um, really neat. Here's the tailgate with a little star on the back as well. Really cool. There's the side. We have the stripes on the side, the white and red stripes. And then we have this little thing coming down. I think that's like supposed to be the belt or something. I can't really remember. It's very small. Um, and we haven't even looked at the 164s yet. So I couldn't even tell you because I haven't even seen the 164s yet. But there's that. I got everything new that I saw 
Um, I saw some of the new 124 scales. I haven't gotten those. That's the only thing I really didn't get. But I will get those eventually um, when I find them for like, you know, a discount at like TJ Maxx or Marshalls or Ross. Um, that'll be coming up in no time probably. Here's the final one here. Iron Man with the red tires, the gold roll cage. And then there's the Iron Man here. Very neat. I did actually review the Marvel truck. I forgot I made the five pack video. But this next pack here, two out of the three in this pack, we have not seen yet. I at least haven't. I have not reviewed either the Thor or the War Machine. We're still waiting for those to come out. We're waiting for Thor to come out in the singles because for some reason we're only getting three out of the four of the singles. I don't know why, but that's why I went ahead and made this video now because even though we only have three out of the four singles, the Thor is not to be seen anywhere right now in the States. So um, I'll, I'll find that at a later date, I guess. And then the War Machine is only in the two packs and I don't think that we have gotten those in the States yet either, only Canada. So let's get this one out of the box. All right, I actually got all three of them out. So let's start off with the Thor. I cannot wait to get this one in 164 scale. I love the hammer on the top. That is really, really cool. Look how that is positioned. It looks very, very cool and very unique on the minis, that's for sure. So there it is, there's the side. You can see the clothing right here, the red clothing or whatever. And then you can see the logo where it says Thor right there. The cool little flaps on the side, the wings, that is really neat. Then there is the hood. Very cool, very small, of course very very neat here's the captain america this is the second variant here's the first one that we got in the pack that we just looked at the one we reviewed has the blue uh roll cage this one has the red then this one has black tires the one that we just opened has blue tires really cool but the bodies are of course are going to be the same so let's see what we got in the last one here nothing new we just got another thor another black panther and an iron man variant so let's get this one out of the box Alrighty, let's take a look at this Iron Man first. Not too bad. Where's the one that we just looked at? The one we just opened before had red wheels. This one has black. And then the one we looked at first has a gold roll cage. This one has a red. Already getting Marvel mini variants. And this is literally my first video on these. Um, so that's crazy. Here's the Black Panther that we just opened. The difference with this one is this one has a purple roll cage. The one previous had a silver roll cage. This one has black wheels where this one had purple. I like this variant more. This one is cleaner. And then this one is Thor. The last one is Thor. Let me get that little thing out. This one has a silver roll cage and like grayish wheels. You can tell there is a color difference. Um, this is like more of a stormy gray. This is like a shinier silver. This one had black wheels and then a stormy gray roll cage. So already already got all these variants of the Marvel. So I'm pretty sure those are the only three packs out right now. In the comments below, tell me if I'm wrong. That one is really cool. This one is Thor I was very happy to get. And now I just suddenly have two Thors. So how about that? Now, let me get all of the trash out of my way and off of the studio. And let's look at the main lines. Can't wait for the Spider-Man one in the singles. But for now, we got Iron Man, uh, Captain America, and Black Panther. I'm going to take a look at Iron Man first. Um, if you guys don't know, this is actually my least favorite one out of all the Marvel trucks. If I'm being honest, it does look a little goofy. I like the Spider-Man a little more. And then Captain America, and then probably Black Panther, and then probably Thor. Out of, the, out of those five, that's how it would go from five to one. So Thor is definitely going to be my favorite. I already know it. Warning, if you try yanking the minis out of the box like I did when I was opening them, the straps came back and popped me in the hand and I am bleeding like someone stabbed me. I don't know how I'm bleeding like that, but just a warning, it happened to me. That's, I don't think I've ever drawn blood on myself opening trucks, but all of them all are just going to be the minis. So that's a little funny. But anyways, here is the Iron Man. Let's get this one out of the box. First off, let's admire the, uh, the packaging of this really neat this thing these series it's going to be quite a pretty penny one day in a few years three to four years give it time i'm sure this is going to be like fire and ice down the road so let's get this out of the box all right not our first iron man review since we have seen it in the five pack already made that video last week but here is the one that comes in the main lines gray chassis red roll cage yellow wheels dkt's on the tires love that and of course we have already reviewed the truck but let's give you guys for the ones who haven't seen it at least on the channel the 360 some i do like about this are the exhaust tips on the rear that looks really cool really really cool and futuristic um the front's all right too i will i will give it that but i don't like the shape of the overall truck um, it, it looks like NEA, but not cool. Not as cool as NEA, because I actually do like NEA. And 
Oh my goodness, what? I didn't even, wow, I didn't even know that we were going to be getting this. Good thing I looked. You will be getting a flag. I guess that's why you're paying three extra dollars, um, seven instead of four dollars, because you're getting a flag. Now, this flag looks like the flag that we got for Hot Wheels Monster Jam uh, for their accessories back in 2017, I believe. Now, this is really cool. Are they the same on both sides? I actually didn't even know this, guys. So let's stick that flag in the truck i think it just goes right there yeah wow that's really cool i don't know why i feel stupid for, stupid for not even knowing that but there it is with the flag really neat let's take a look at the next one guys we're going to be taking a look at the captain america oh it's right here all right it's captain america guys there it is let's get it out of the box all right let's now that we know they have flags let's get the flag out of the bottom here and here's the captain america flag very cool here's the captain america blue roll cage gray chassis bkt's red wheels and then here is the truck really cool love the shield on it this is what it looks like in 164 we looked at it in the minis now here it is on the 164 captain america logo right there that's a really cool font i like that um a star on the front man this is really cool i like this one more than the iron man but i don't think i like it as much as the black panther but that is what the captain america looks like with the flag quick little last minute last uh final 360 right there now let's get the black panther out of the box here's the final main line all right let's see this flag this one's cool i love this black and purple there it is there's the flag for black panther and there's the other side it's kind of hard to catch it right without the light glaring on it now here's the truck and this is what i meant with the honeycomb uh kind of design on it you guys can kind of see the the cool pattern in parts of the truck very cool nothing on the hood right there but a very unique shape of course they have that same pattern going on the tailgate right there or on the rear i should say um you can kind of see a better example of it there there's the black panther logo right there the mouse gem logo very very cool i love the spikes on the hood i pointed that out when we reviewed it in the five packs and now let's get the flag on this guy uh purple roll cage by the way same color as the wheels or yeah the wheels black tires black roll cage very nice clean uh variant of the black panther all right guys well i have mystery mutters there's no point of really just unboxing them but i can show you i got two iron mans and one spider-man so there it is this is what the new mystery mutters look like and the packaging is really neat i do like it almost don't want to open them but of course we have to reveal what variant we got since we got two iron mans i hope we got different variants because they'll have iron man one variants and iron man two variants it says 15 plus variants so that is actually not too many variants that means there's 60 overall between the two and um actually i don't know i don't know if they mean 15 variants for hang on let me see so this one has a red chassis oh, right there you can kind of see it this one has a gray so we'll be getting two different variants um this is probably iron man one and this is probably iron man two and they made um, well, i guess 15 variants of each i'm assuming and then we have the spider-man only one spider-man so there's no reason to really you know unbox them or anything it's they're just brown so let's get to the bathroom let me get these open and let's Turn the faucet on and see which variant we get. All right, turn the water on. It's already hot, ready to go. Here is what they look like out of the box, by the way. This is Spider-Man, uh, Spider-Man probably two. You can see this one has a blue roll cage and a red chassis, as you can see. Here are the two Iron Mans. Iron Man, I'm assuming two. This one has like a tannish color uh, roll cage, it looks like, and a red base. This one has a silver base. So already gonna know we're gonna get different variants let's take this one and put it under the water first all right faucet is on let's get the mud off of the iron man here wow this one looks cool i don't know of any of the variants really but i just know this one looks really neat hang on guys almost there i want to get all the mud off the tires too because i'm just gonna forget about it and then it's just gonna have mud on it still once it's on my shelf and i don't want that so let me get all the remains off let's turn the water off and here is our first variant wow look at this one this is iron man one number two two out of 15 guys that's not bad i love the i don't know the two-tone is like a darker like tannish and then we have like the gold color that's usual you know but there it is now let's take a look at the one and only spider-man that we got here's what it looks like before let's put it under the water all right i think the mud came off of that one pretty quickly here is the spider-man this is spider-man 101 wow and this one is cool look at this one guys i like the variant on this one i love the colors 
Um, I actually saw someone in the collecting group on Facebook post this exact variant, and I was like, man, it'd be cool if I got that variant, and here it is, sure enough. There's SM101. Now, for the final Iron Man, guys. Here it is. We already know this is gonna be Iron Man 2. Let's put it under the water and see what variant it is. Get out of here. Look at these colors, man. Chrome silver with the black two-tone and a red top. Wow, just to match the base. That is cool. This is Iron Man 2, 03. So we got Spider-Man 1, 01, Iron Man 1, 02, and Iron Man 2, 03. Wow, that is a tongue twister. And I bet it took you a second to realize exactly what I meant by that because, wow, so many 1, 2, and 3s. But <laughs> there it is. Let's get the camera lifted. I dried my hands off and show you guys the final look of the variants. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Tell me what you guys thought about this. I always love showing you guys the mystery mutters. Man, this is definitely the coolest one. And then I'll say this is the second. So we went in order of best to last and I didn't even realize because they were mysteries. So that is what I call my least favorite to most favorite for today's mystery mutters. Thank you guys for watching once again. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. I'd appreciate it a lot. I'm always hunting and always making in-store videos. If you enjoy that, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button to see more, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.